Yep, that's right. Today I'm going to show you how to set up your Meta Quest headset. And this tutorial works for almost all models, including the Quest 2, 3 and 3S. With that being said, let's jump right in, shall we? And I'll show you how to make the magic happen. Okay, so first you want to make sure your headset and controllers are fully charged. When they're ready, take a seat and put on the Quest. You should be able to see your surroundings with in the middle a window asking you to adjust the fit of your device by one securing the top strap at a comfy level and two tilting the headset forward or backward until the screen is clear. Let's say the screen remains blurry, move on to adjusting the lenses. It's important to know that the lenses have three settings which correspond to different eye distances. Setting 1 is 58mm, setting 2 is 63mm and setting 3 is 68mm. To figure out which uh, setting works best for you, I recommend downloading the iMeasure app, which uh, calculates your exact measurement so you can adjust the lenses to the setting closest to your needs. Now, if you wear glasses, then use the spacer included in the box. Insert it in between the face cover and the quest to create extra room. Once everything fits comfortably, you're ready to connect to the Wi-Fi. It is recommended you choose a local network and after connecting, the Quest will restart to install the latest software. When the update is complete, the headset will play a sound. So use this time to grab your phone or tablet and download the Quest Companion app, which is called Meta Horizon, available on both iOS and Android. And when the app has finally been downloaded to your phone slash tablet, log in or sign up with your email. Not long after, a pop-up will ask you to pair your new headset. Congrats! In case you do not see this, then don't worry. On your home screen, tap your profile and open the menu. Look for the headset symbol labeled Devices and here you can connect a new headset as well. Select the model of your Quest and allow the app a moment to locate and pair with your device. It should only take a minute or two and you'll see a green check mark once it's done. If it does take longer than expected or in the end fails to connect, try manually entering the pairing code displayed inside the headset. This usually, usually solves the problem. But if it doesn't, here are some other troubleshooting tips you can try. So you could restart the Wi-Fi on your phone for example, double check if you are connected to the same local network on both your phone and Quest, reboot your headset or as a last resort, perform a factory reset. If you're still having issues, then you should reach out to Meta's support team. Once the pairing is successful, put the headset back on and after a brief tutorial, you can start exploring everything Quest has to offer, such as becoming Batman in glorious virtual reality or monkeying around in Gorilla Tag. In case you ever need that pairing code again, you can find it in the main settings by going to system and then in about you can stare at it as long as you like. I know, it's well hidden away. And there you go. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was useful. If it was, then make sure to subscribe for more Quest content and also check out my tips and tricks video if you want to get the most out of your headset. There's a link in the description or you can click on the video right over here. Until next time and uh, bye bye for now.